I did gluten free for about one hour. No gluten for this guy. And that was lunch. Sandwiches are the cornerstones of life. So, one of my favorite sandwiches, I'm gonna start off right here. I'm gonna do this one on wheat bread. Now, I like to butter my backsides. <laughs> this is when, you know, you get that little brownage on the back when you throw it in the toaster. A little chipotle mayo. This is the Vogue mayo. It's mayo basically with a little sriracha. It is the mayo that came on, you know, in the late 2000s. I'm gonna put a little bit of Dijon mustard mixed on top of that. The Dijon is what's gonna give it that all right, let's get a little turkey on here. This is organically raised turkey from Turkey. This is where I, I make sure all of my turkey comes from Turkey. You know what's gonna be interesting here to add? Everyone knows a good sharp is just the best cheese. I'm gonna cut me a little piece there. Look at that. Bobby Flay, <laughs> fall back, son. <laughs> you don't want none of this. Now, ladies and gentlemen, Bacon. We got turkey bacon. Everyone's doing turkey bacon. It's in, okay? I get it. But if you really want taste, which is what I'm going for, let's get these, let's get, let's go down in the bottom. Because <laughs> that's where we got that bacon bacon right down there. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Yeah, yeah, that's gonna be good. Now, this is a, you know, <laughs> essential to most sandwich makers. People don't have no idea, but, uh, Cognac is, uh, in, you're, you're asking me, does this go on the sandwich? No, it goes with. And this is for all you kids out there, okay? Uncle Cedric says it's fine. Find your dad's stash and uh, make yourself a good sandwich. I am joking, or am I? So, yeah, I didn't normally drink this until I had kids. I used to make all my sandwiches with, you know, like high, high C or Shasta. Everything's making a comeback. You know what we need to do is we need to take Shasta and put it in some kind of cool restaurant in Brooklyn. It'll be the hottest thing. It'll be like craft Shasta. You'll go have Shasta gardens. Mmm. <laughs> all righty. Oh, ooh, ooh, I wish you could see that from here. All right, now look at what we have here. A little bacon, look at that cheddar, nice. Melted down there because I like my sandwiches spicy and then I want a little bit of fun to it. So what we have here is some red pepper jelly. Takes your taste buds on this crazy roller coaster ride. It's like, ah, oh my God, this is crazy. Take a picture of me for Instagram while I bite my sandwich. Uh, I'm gonna lay a few tomatoes on this. Just put the pickle here. Give me a good little attitude. And then some lettuce. Secret weapon, guys. I always add a couple of Doritos in on the sandwich. Always not your cheese. Any of you Cool Ranch people out there, uh, okay, jump off a bridge. Never Cool Ranch. Uh, ooh. And I'm just gonna show you the inside of that sandwich. Look at that. This is Cedric the Entertainer, grown ass manwich. <laughs> Word. Mm. Now, as you may have heard me allude a couple of times, I'm married and my wife won't let me eat this sandwich. So I'm gonna show you another sandwich that I have to eat when Let's do here. I'm gonna cut some ciabatta. Make a little salmon sandwich. Chipotle mayo on there. This time I just use a regular yellow mustard. Now there is some turkey bacon left and you won't go in the sandwich, but because it's around, you eat it. And this is a good time to have a little more cognac right now. It makes the sandwich taste so much better. Condiments here, my tomato. We'll dress that up, make it nice and pretty. I'm so pretty. De le salmon. This is a fresh Atlantic salmon from Atlantic City. So you can put it there. It looks beautiful. Let me take that. Mmm. Ciabatta, you don't want to take your chance going in a diagonal. The wife's sandwich, what I like to call the 
honey, I'm home. This is when she's there and I go, oh, hi, hey, honey. Yeah, I'm here. Look, what I'm just getting a little bite. That's what I'm doing. And she goes, what did you make yourself? And I said, well, a salmon sandwich. And she says, that is good, babe. Can I have a piece of that? And I'm sure, like, sure. Look how satisfying. You call it delicious. I call it delightful. Happy eating out there. <laughs>